हेलो एंड वेलकम दिस इज नंदनी हिरानी एंड यू आर वाचिंग इट्स टुमारो न्यूज नहारिया बिसीड बाय फ्लड्स आफ्टर वायलेंट क्लाउड बर्स्ट अ वायलेंट क्लाउड बर्स्ट हिट नहारिया इजराइल ऑन वेंसडे लेड टू वाइड स्प्रेड फ्लडिंग इन व्हिच वन पर्सन लॉस्ट इज हिज लाइफ दिस वाज द सेकंड सीवियर स्टॉर्म विद इन अ वीक फॉलोइंग द फर्स्ट वन ऑन जनवरी 4 दैट क्लेम्ड फोर लाइफ इन तेल अवीव हाइफा एंड गिवात निली According to the police a man was carried away by flood waters after attempting to rescue passengers of an overturned vehicle His body was retrieved later on by emergency services None of the passengers sustained major injuries the police added Naharia saw extensive flooding on Wednesday the tractors and military vehicles were used to help transport residents across streets submerged in waters Around 100 students were trapped at an elementary school according to local news Dozens of dogs were also rescued from an animal shelter in the city. The Education Ministry cancelled classes for Thursday in Naharia and some nearby cities and regional councils. Naharia mayor remarked that preparations for the storm were taken prior to the devastating event, but the Gatao River that runs along the city's major street was not able to absorb all rain leading to its swelling. In Ashod city the Megan David Adam ambulance service said it received numerous calls from trapped people particularly in elevators due to power disruption Authorities advise residents to stay indoors as much as possible until the storm is over The Israel Airport Authority also advised travelers to be prepared for possible delays due to the storm The railroad in the Haifa center Hashoma railway station area was inundated after a 50 mm cloud burst that hit the area in less than 2 hours Police and local authorities closed several roads and sites in Haifa metropolitan area. The fire service warned people to avoid subterranean parking lots in events of floods and refrain from using elevators below ground level. On January 4, a couple died after being trapped in a flooded elevator in Tel Aviv. The city received 20% of its annual rainfall in just 2 hours on the same day. According to forecasts high winds are expected to calm on Friday that is January 10 and rain to gradually stop on Saturday that is January 11 That's all for now for more news updates stay tuned with us it's tomorrow news Nandini Hirani For more news updates like these please subscribe our channel